Right, Happy New Year from North Ferry Fan TV. It's a little bit windy, so if you can't hear us very well, we'll get closer to our lovely faces just in case you can't hear us. Um, we're going to go through the teams today. Right, um, so, you carry away, Andrew. I'll go for um, I'm Thought Welfare first. Uh, the goal I've got Leigh Overton, two Tyler Walker, he's also the captain, three James Arnold. Yeah, why not? Josh Burkett, Alan Jackson, Josh Dodd, Jason Crisp, and Josh Simpkins. And it was for us because I haven't seen the team. I ain't seen the team yet. So Lewis Exall, number one, two, Ben Leyland, three, jo Joel Shortland, four, Levi Tarbottom, five, James Piercy, six, Jamie Forrester, seven, Joe Dale, eight, Lewis Kirk, nine, Tom Connor, ten, Eddie Birch, and eleven, Danny Mills. A good team. Man. What a team. That is a good team. Look for the referee can referee this time and the other team did stall and cheat like the last game we went to. Yeah. Or the last time we were against Anthony Wolf and they were just fine. So the shoes. Oh, well, Lawrence is though, isn't it? Oh, okay. Shot is Joel's number three. Yep. Leyland, Shortland, Tabbert and Piercy. Yeah. Right. Eddie Birch, though, I mean, Eddie Birch. Great player. I am a um, Ben Leyland. <laughs> ben Leyland was man of the match last week as well. Um, but we can't start by uh, not mentioning the appalling decision that the NCL, NCEL have made about um, replaying the match against Rossington and uh, my mate Winter. Um, so I am going to see him again, I'll see him at home again, so uh, I'll park myself in the stadium near him when he comes back, um, just in case he's got a gob on a stick syndrome again. Um, just absolutely appalling, falling up, nine minutes to go, and it's, the, uh, do you know what I mean, they've made a decision last season of another team that they gave it to the team that were falling up when there was eight or nine minutes left, and yet we're having to replay ours. It's absolutely disgusting. I should be ashamed. I keep tweeting them, and I will keep tweeting you in CEL for a, a thorough decision. Yes, the floodlights went out, but like two minutes after you abandoned it, the floodlights came on and stayed on for like 45 minutes afterwards. I know, because we were here. Absolutely disgusting. What do you think? Um, well, you pretty much, you pretty much should have well, you, you can say yours <laughs> to the camera. Um, yeah, the refereeing was, was awful, um, but the referee's decision, there was no stopping that referee being awful. If we'd have had a good referee, the game, it would have still happened the same way. Yeah. It was the other team that were the real disgrace, stalling, claiming they couldn't see anything, whereas we went to where they would have been playing and you could see perfectly. Um, there, the players when they got in the locker room, uh, when they were supposed to, when they weren't supposed to, because they just sodded off in there when they weren't supposed they to. Did, they stayed there. It's yeah, they done me out big time. Yeah. Disgraceful by them when uh, the North Ferry fans were. I mean, yeah, the North Ferry fans were winding them up, but you know, you would. It was, you were. It was pretty funny. They deserved it. Um, you know, just awful reactions by them. They should have just ignored the North Ferry fans that were annoying them and instead they just threw water at them, which, you know, isn't the worst thing to happen in the world, but it's still, you know, they're meant to be a football team, not some, like, kids on a playground in year five. Well, know? they were kids. They, they stormed off. They stormed off. They were, they, were, they acted like kids. They stormed off in the locker room when, when as, soon as, as soon as the floodlight went out. The goalkeeper, apparently, apparently, I'm not saying definitely because I've not seen him, um, the goalkeeper apparently said he couldn't see where... Like two of our videos showed on the way here that you could see it absolutely perfectly. And that was about a minute after the game was abandoned. Yeah, so it wouldn't have about changed. a minute afterwards. We were on our way here to interview people. Yeah. Absolutely disgusting. I hope there's a person who has this thing here today. I'm going to see him. There's a bloke there with a the clipboard. I wonder if he's from the FA. I'll go and have a look. I'll go and ask him. 
him. See if we can have an interview for the decision. Yeah. The appalling decision that was made. Anyway, line up today. Yeah, anyway, that's behind us, you know, that disgraceful referee, disgraceful team. Yeah. It's gone, not fair, still played well in that game. Not fair, we've still been playing well constantly, game after game. Yeah. Good squad on today. I thought last time we played them, um, I can't remember, I think, I'm pretty they sure won. we, they won. They did won. They? Yeah, they won at home. They beat us. Right. But. Good team. I remember that they were quite good. Look, both teams are quite evenly matched here, I'd say. Well, I would say that since then we've made signings and, you know, we've, oh, gelled, yeah, we've, together we've a, better, yeah. gelled together better as a team. Obviously, I don't know if Armthorpe have improved. They're, they're not they're not got a rubbish league position, but they're not no. great either. Um, you know, we are great, but we've got, like, three games left to replay. So, anyway, so we're here. We'll be here, study here, waiting. You can come for a selfie, come for an interview if you don't want us. If you don't want an interview, just come and have a selfie. You know, we don't mind pulling faces or whatever. Yeah, why not? <laughs> um, we'll be here um, until, like, 10 to yeah. 3, yeah. and then we'll be here after the game. Come yeah. and join us. All right? See you.